and welcome to Reggie's Routines. Oh, he's so excited, I'm gonna have to let him go already. So, um, we're going to do some work today to get your heart rate up and keep you nice and active and nice and fit so that even though we can't be together at school, you can still have a PE lesson in your house. So you're not gonna need a lot of space for this, but we'll play some games. So we're going to play, rather than Simon Says, we're gonna play Reggie Says. So remember, listen really carefully to the instructions and if Reggie doesn't say it, don't do it. Okay then, so first of all, sit in there nicely. So Reggie Says Straddle. Reggie says pike. Reggie says tuck. Reggie says pike. Straddle. Did you do it? Reggie says straddle. Reggie says tuck. Reggie says stand up. Reggie says straight. Reggie says star. 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 Reggie says straight. Star. Did you do it? Reggie says star. Okay. Reggie says jog on the spot. Reggie says bum kicks. Reggie says jump on the spot. And hop. Uh oh. Reggie didn't say. Reggie says hop. Reggie says other foot. Reggie says hopscotch. And stop. Oh, Reggie says stop. Okay, well done everybody. Hopefully your heart's beating a little bit faster now. So what we're going to do is we're going to do some um, different exercises. So some will work on that core strength that we talk about at school, making sure your body is nice and strong and not all wibbly wobbly. Okay, so first thing we're going to do is we're going to do some running on the spot. Okay, so when we run on the spot, make sure I can't hear Mr. and Mrs. Elephant stomping around. But we use the balls of our feet to so lift your heels up a bit as so you're nice and light so I shouldn't hear you. That doesn't mean you've got to do tiptoe running, we can still run fast, but nice and light on the balls of your feet. Okay, ready everybody? Let's do some running and go. We'll be listening carefully, can I hear you? That's good, keep going. Keep going. Run as fast as you can. And stop. Okay, well done. The next one we're going to do is a uh, front support. So remember, when we do our front support, we don't want any bottoms in the air. We don't want any banana backs. We want to put our weight, our, sh our hands underneath our shoulders and squeeze our tummy muscles really tightly. Okay, so look down between your hands. Up you go and squeeze. And see if you can hold that. Make sure you haven't got a bottom in the air. Make sure you're not dropping your hips. Are you perfect? Okay, right, that was your practice. This time we're going to try and do it and hold it for 10 seconds. So we're all going to count. Ready? And squeeze. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10. Well done if you held that for 10 seconds. Reggie was counting then, I think. Okay then, next thing we're going to do is we're going to do some frog jumps. So this will really get your heart rate pumping. So remember we're going from all the way on the floor like a frog and we're going to jump up really high, as high as we can for the frog jumps. Ready? Let's see how long we can do some frog jumps for. Ready? Here we go. And jump all the way up and all the way down. Keep frog jumping. That's it. Who can be the highest frog and jump the highest? All the way up, all the way down. Keep going. And stop there. Super. Okay. 
So by now, we should be starting to feel a little bit warm. Put your hands on your chest. Can you feel your heart beating now? Okay. Right then, next one we're going to do is a back support. So remember this time, we're still making ourselves nice and straight. We're using those tummy muscles and we're gonna push your hips up to the ceiling, okay? Make sure you look up at the ceiling as well because that will help you and stop your bottom from dropping. Okay, everybody ready? Have a little practice, here we go, push up. Remember, look, I've got nice straight legs. I've not got my feet on the floor, no bent knees. Nice straight legs and push and look up. Keep pushing and down we go. Right then, that was your practice. This time we're going to try and do it for 10 seconds. So we're going to do it and we're going to count to 10. Now Reggie's come and sat so he's going to watch and make sure I've done it. Ready, here we go. Up and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well done, did I do it Reggie? Well wow, done if you did it too. Okay, right then. This time we're going to do some bunny hops. So this time we're going to come like you're doing a front support but we're going to jump your feet in and out like a bunny rabbit, okay? So we'll see how long we can do those for. So ready, here we go, go in and out and in and out. So you can do these slowly or you see if you can go a bit faster. See if you've got a fast bunny or a slow one. Keep going with those bunny hops, keep going everybody. So she's making sure I'm doing mine, I can see him watching me over there. So in and out, in and out. Keep going, let's do five more. One, two, three, four, five. Well done. Okay, this time we're going to do some Superman or superwoman. So, we're going to lie on our front, on our tummies. Okay. And we're going to lift up and we're going to try and fly through the air. So, our legs and so our arms aren't touching the floor. Okay, so we're going to lift up and see if you can fly. How high can you come on your tummy? Lift and down we go. Okay, that was your practice. This time we're gonna hold it for 10. Ready? Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yay, well done. Okay then, this time we're gonna do some monster stumps. So this time we're gonna do some big steps, making sure we're getting really low like a monster. So we're gonna stand up, your knees feet on the spot, hands on your hips, and we're gonna stomp down each time. How low can you go? Keep stomping, big stomps. So lift your leg up and stomp down, stomp down. Keep going. Really low. Let's see, five more. One, two, three, four, five. Well done, big monster stumps. Okay, this is gonna be our last exercise now. So, We've done a front support and we've done a back support. This time we're going to see if we can do it on our side. So this time I'm going to put my hand down this way. I'm going to put one foot on top of the other, okay? I can split a little bit if I need to, but try and keep one foot on top of the other and I'm gonna push my hips up to the sky. 
Okay, so I'm gonna come up like this. Okay, I squeeze these muscles. Don't let your hips drop. Keep squeezing up. You can put your hand up as well if you can. That's it. Squeeze, that's it, count to five. One, two, three, four, five. Well done. We're gonna do the same thing on the other side. So get ready. Hand underneath your shoulder, remember. And push up, see if you can get one foot on top of the other and push those hips up. Okay, keep holding it. Let's count to five. One, two, three, four, five. Well done. And we've done all the exercises we need to. So by now you should be feeling a little bit hot. Your breath should be going a bit faster and your heart rate should be going faster. So just to make sure we're calming down, we're gonna sit, listen to our heart, feel it beating. And see if you can just slow your breathing until you can't really hear it anymore. And as your body cools down, your breathing gets slower and your heart rate gets slower. Okay, well done. I hope you've been keeping nice and active and well done for doing Reggie's routine.